Hey guys, Stinker here. Welcome back to our first episode of our community character review series. I'm super, super excited for this one, more so than anything else I've done before. Why? Because, guys, I get to showcase your hard work and dedication here. So, thanks to Flo Bender here for um, handing me over his character. So, my man's here has spent a lot of work, a lot of love and attention into this. So, this is his current uh, ship here. It's an absolute monstrosity, right? Uh, we'll jump in and have a see what's inside, but this thing looks absolutely decked out like you would not believe, right? So he's got Santa Slay there, he's got some uh, turrets on the back. I mean, you're covered from every angle here. This is a kiting mobile and a uh, half. I mean, maxed out everything. Holy moly, this thing is looking sweet and compact, right? Um, next up, he's got the Rum Runner here. <laughs> I love the name. Nice color um, scheme as well. He's also got the Razor Mantis. I love, I really like the color on this one, actually. It's absolutely amazing. Um, and then, last but not least, he's got the Beetle Juicer here. What is this thing? Holy moly. That's fat. Love it. Absolutely love it. And he's got the same um, tight formation with some missiles launches there. This guy does not mess about. Anyways, um, in terms of the character, so he's level 60. Let's have a look at his skill tree here. So he said he abstained from uh, going up the combat trees to make the game more challenging for himself. So what has he invested in stealth? Very nice, given the weapons he's running. Very good choice there. Good, good synergies. He's got weightlifting because he does a lot of base building, so on and so on. He likes to collect loot. Gymnastics. So what does he get here? So slide, oh, combat slide. Nice. Cool. So he's got a few social commas to be expected. Gastronomy. What does he get from this? So research. Okay, nice. Persuasion. Essential for any RPG. He's got theft. He's got manipulation here. Very good. Um... Ship command, I would have expected to have that one because these ships are maxed out. Uh, instigating, what's this one? Nice, okay, cool. Combat, he's just got explosives in there. Science, he's got some interesting ones here. So, you got research methods, you got surveying, weapon engineering, nice, nice, very nice. Zoology and spacesuit design. So, he's gone down the crafting path here, which is perfectly fine. Boost pack, my man. Okay, cool. I, I cannot preach the importance of maxing this out. You need it. And also, this is very good too. Uh, so, he's got piloting, security, targeting is maxed out. Um, starship design is maxed out. Shield system is maxed out. Very good, very good. I mean, the only thing he, he can do better is just particle weapons. But he's not running particle guns anyway. So, it doesn't really make that much of a difference. In terms of weapons though, he's got some beauties in here. So, he's got the Mangler. Um, what is it? Anti-personnel, crippling, and shattering. Shattering, very good perk there. And he's got five out of six mods on it. He's got the Max Storm with two out of two mods. Cornered, oh, beautiful. One of the best perks you can get for this. Staggering, titanium build makes it nice and light. He's got the Shoddy. Very interesting build, this one. So what does this have? Hand loading and furious. Very nice, very nice. He's got the sneaker. <laughs> <laughs> um, so what do you guys this one? Crippling Anti-Personnel Titanium build. That's a really cool build, by the way. Uh, he's got the Kraken here. One inch punch, of course. Med Theft, Furious. Good, good mods on it. And this is the, the I think, the, the Crowd Jewel, Crowd Jewel connect, collection there, which is the Lacerate and Instigating. Holy moly. If that has Shattering, that would be the biggest God Roll I've ever seen. Anyways, um, so that's that one there. My man is not tight on money either, so he's got a fair bit of cash to play around with there. <laughs> he's, he's the Jeff Bezos of Starfield. Guys, this this is very, very awesome. Anyways, let's let's go and, and do a um go and do a raid here. Oh, so this is his home base here as well, isn't it? Yeah, that's his home base. So he said he wants to do a hunting outpost here, which is Awesome. All right, that's this is an interesting planet. All right, just let's check uh, settings, gameplay. Very hard to perfect. That's what we need. All right, let's just go and uh, test this character out and push it through the paces there. So what what has he got here, right? He's got particles. And the turrets at the back, okay. So he's got those guns there. Nice. And he's got the turrets. Alright, cool. Alright, without further ado. What's his total shields? 
2.1k. Nice. Okay. Um, actually, before we do that, what companions does he have? Let's have a quick look at his crew. He's got Andrea, Barrett, Stealth Particle Beam is nice, Ballistic, Star and Ship Engineering. Yeah, he's got some really, really crew me good crew members here. He's invested a lot of time in it. Okay, alright. Uh, I'm just going to check it out. See how we go. Perfect opportunity to test out our ship here. Okay. Why am I tired? Turret's not firing. What the heck? Ah, oh, looks like I got that bug. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Oh no, they're firing now. Nice, very well-rounded gun. I mean, the way he's got he's got position, his turrets, your back is always covered, and then for the front you got that. Very good setup. Very, very good setup. Very smart. Okay, let's just drop here and test out the uh, character combat. Guys, I, I love it when you see how much attention someone has put into their characters. This is absolutely amazing. Amazing stuff. Also, I'm pretty sure we're the first ones to test this out, so I'm very proud that we get to pioneer this. You know, I've not seen any other channel do this, so thank you guys, thank you. It, it means a lot that you keep sending me these files. Alright, so what do we have here? Um, no bases? Interesting. Uh, let me try here. Alright, there you go. Those guys do not know what's coming their way. Alright. Interesting. Cool. He's got hotkeyed everything. That's amazing. Oh, he's even got the um stuff stuff <laughs> starbomb powers. So I'm not I'm not going to use any of those though. Let me just quickly check his armor here. Anti ballistics weapon holster sentinel. Nice, okay, cool, perfect. Alright, let's see how we go. I I don't expect this is gonna be much of a challenge, guys. Does he have any does he have any frost wolves here we can pop? No, no frost wolf, that's okay. Alright. I mean, he's designed this character for stealth, and that's exactly how we're going to use it. Oh, this thing is this thing is uh, semi-automatic. Interesting. Oh man, if you if you change this to just just single shot, it will it would slap even harder. Oh, this is a robot facility here. Nice. Very nice. Alright, let's just drop down. Alright, so here's what we're going to do here. Uh, B1. B2. B3. Thank you very much. Med pack, credits.
Okay. Get deleted. Oh, let's see what they got for us. Okay, switch to the grenade launcher here. Clapped. Insanely strong. Those guys got hit so hard they still glitched. They got no idea what's happening to them. That's crazy. Is that because the stealth perks? These guys are like absolutely bugged. They got they got no idea what's coming for them. Why is the game so bugged? Holy moly. This whole thing just glitched out. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. That is hilarious. Oh, right, guys, there's no point in me doing this facility. For some reason, they just bugged out. I don't know why. Maybe it's the, the way that... The, it wouldn't be the safe part because everything else was working fine. I mean... Look, this is absolutely insane. The, the amount of love and dedication is put in this character. You guys can see it, right? I mean, let, let me just go back to um, the original save here. He's, he's perfect, his character, to his play style. Like, there's no right or wrong way to play here. He's absolutely perfected it. And kudos, man. Kudos to you. You've done a great job. Thank you for sending this through. I've had absolute pr pleasure just reviewing and going through it. I mean, this, this, is, this is insane, right? Absolutely insane. What you've managed to accomplish here. I'll take it you play in third person as well. Oh, this is, yeah, this is, this is insane, man. Thanks again, guys. Please don't forget to send through your characters. Um, we'll give them a run as well. Uh, anyways, this has been an absolute pleasure. Dimpo out.